Hello Sagittarius, welcome to Truth Well Told Tarot. This is Andrea and I'm here to do your weekly tarot reading for the sign of Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. And it will be from the 26th of April to the 2nd of May 2021. So let's pull your angel card and see what we have for you for the week, Sagittarius. Message for Sagittarius for the week, please, angels, spirits, guides. Okay. Uh, two cards. I've got get more information and we have take action. I feel one of, I think, I feel this is leading on one from the other. So more information is needed on how you take action. Now that could be going within and considering your actions carefully. It could also be some practical information that you need. Yeah, okay. So, message for Sagittarius, please, angels, spirits, guides. Message for our lovely Sagittarians, thank you. And it will be 26th of April to the 2nd of May, 2021. Starting with the challenge position. What do we have for Sagittarius? Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, four of cups, which can be about deep thought. Five of Pentacles, advice from spirit, and your near future outcome, we have the Queen of Cups. What do we have for Sagittarius, please? Angels, spirits, guides, message for our lovely Sagittarius, thank you. Can we clarify the cards on the table for Sagittarius? And it will be 26th of April to the 2nd of May. Thank you. Message for Sagittarius, please. Thank you. I knew that was going to come out, you know. I was, I was thinking the Six of Cups. I knew that was going to happen. Okay, so we have the Five of Pentacles, yeah, Five of Cups. This is the advice from Spirit. And we have the Queen of Cups with the Nine of Pentacles. Bottom of the deck, we have the Ace of Cups. Sagittarius, this is an energy of... I'm feeling in this situation someone's coming back you know the six of cups can generally be about revisiting the past and there's a message of whether you want to revisit the past or not because somebody's reaching out but in the challenge position it's kind of like oh, actually I've moved on from the past and I don't really know if I want to um, go there again yeah so I'm definitely getting in this energy. Somebody is coming in and it feels to do with love, romance, relationships. But this is, there's definitely an energy of you don't know if this is for you anymore. You know, I, I don't know if I want to revisit the past because it feels like you've moved on. Advice from Spirit. So we have the Five of Pentacles, which, you know, is to do with feeling lack, insufficiency, out in the cold. It can be to do with rejected. Um, it can also be to do with uh, financial loss as well, some financial change or loss in a situation. So it might well be in this situation, somebody might be coming back for money reasons. So again, that might be why you need to get more information before you take action um, but it feels in this situation the five of cups is they regret what's gone I mean it feels to do with this it feels that there was an end of a relationship here Sagittarius for whatever reason and I'm definitely getting in this situation someone regrets their actions and there's sometimes an energy with the Five of Cups of all is not lost. They're hoping everything isn't lost. 
you know, because they regret. They found it difficult to move on from a situation or from you, I'm feeling. Um, like I said, for some of you, the pentacles can be to do with relationships, you know, people we build our lives with. Can be to do with money, career, can be to do with health. Could be health reasons as well. But for whatever reason, they're getting back in contact because they regret and it feels there's something that they regret here. And it, this can be about loss, regret, looking back, feeling down, mourning something that's gone. It's that kind of energy. And I'm feeling that this was a relationship here. The Nine of Pentacles, and I'm definitely getting this energy with the Nine of Pentacles, is somebody is standing in their own success, their self-worth, independently. They've built a life for themselves independently of this person. Yeah. And they're feeling pretty good about life. They have, you know, material comfort, reward, abundance, probably excelling in terms of money, career, finances. Uh, and they're standing in their own success here. But we have this Queen of Cups. And she can be about compassion. She can be about caring and compassion. It, you know, the Queen of it feels in this energy and she's holding this Ace of Cups, which is generally a, some kind of offer, a loving gesture, an offer, um, an expression of love here. And it's generally linked to a new beginning, you know, a new beginning, new start, next phase, next level. So, so I'm definitely getting in this energy. Somebody's coming back. They regret their actions. I'm feeling in this energy they want you to show compassion and care, consideration. Now, for some of you, it feels they just want the relationship back on because, you know, the Ace of Cups is um, an offer of love. You know, somebody expressing their love, somebody having feelings, um, loving feelings for somebody. Their heart is opening, you know, it feels in this energy... Uh, this this ace of cups is to do with new love or renewal of love and someone wants you to show care and compassion but here's the energy you know you are feeling pretty good you know you are feeling pretty good i'm getting for some of you some of you it will be to do with the relationship itself some of you it will be to do with they want some money. I'm getting some money from you, you know, and they want you to show care and compassion. I feel somebody might be asking for some money. But definitely in this energy, it might well be that love is one motivating re reason, but I also feel love and money might also be a motivating re reason in this, in this reading. Interesting energy, and that's what I'm getting, Sagittarius, you know, because this is somebody who has plenty, and this is somebody who has insufficient funds. Yeah, so make of it what you will. Now, it could be to do with, if it's not to do with a, a relationship here, it could be to do with children. That's the other thing that I'm getting. It could be children coming back, hoping that there's still hope in the situation, but I'm feeling in this energy, some of you, it might be money, okay? And that's why you wanted to get more information before you take action, you know? And I'm, I'm definitely getting this energy, pay attention to those cards. You wanna see the full picture, you know, the big picture almost before you make a decision or choice. Interesting. I've got whale, show com we've got whale tenderness, show compassion and forgive what needs to be forgiven. That could be in love, that could also be in love and money areas. And another card is, we have bat, listen up. You are working through deep soul patterns, release any outdated beliefs that surface. So there we have it, Sagittarius. That is the re reading for you for the week. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please do like, share and subscribe. And I will see you next time. Thank you.